Yeah. What do we got? What do we know? What are we talking about? Alright, talk about the new guy you got. It's a mama. Say his name a lot. Really? <laughs> that's, really? That's how you, really? <laughs> name is that's how we gonna start the interview out? Oh, oh, never mind, bro. <laughs> He told me, uh, he told me, uh, Moo. Moo, yeah, he Moo, said, yeah. called him Moo. So, yeah. Moo joined us today. Uh, he's a big body. We play the Warriors tomorrow. They've got Looney. They've got uh, Damian James. They've got some big bodies. So you can never, you know, you can never have enough big bodies, whether it's for rebounding, whether it's in pick and roll with some of our guards. Uh, just an insurance guy. Hopefully he can come in and help us out. We're going to play eight games. That's our goal. We want to play eight games here in Summer League, which means a lot of back. Oops, sorry. Turnover number one. A lot of back to back to back, potentially. Yeah, yeah. Bodies are important. Health's important for all our guys. That's another insurance piece for us. So we'll find out more about them as the week goes on. So also another eight games, basically, it's, you're not here just to evaluate. Y'all are trying to win games. Well, I mean, when they step on the court to do shooting drills, it's competitive. And when we show up in Utah and Las Vegas, it's to win. It's to compete. It's to get better. It's still about development. But, you know, it's a competitive. These guys are all competitors. They've all been challenged, good and bad, for different reasons. Um, they all have something to prove. You know, winning helps them. What do you guys want to carry over from Salt Lake, and what do you want to change and improve? I think the good thing... Uh, is that we have the same guys. And this is the first time we've done this, where we've had the same team through training camp into Utah here at Las Vegas. So what they learned, what they struggled with, some success, they won last night. There was a comeback attempt uh, two nights before. Just try and carry that momentum and, and hopefully they've been getting better every game and just try and see if we can start, start a little bit better here in Las Vegas. Markel always says he wants to work on everything narrow down some specifics you'd like to see him work on? He's going to work on defense first. Okay. Uh, you know, that's my area of uh, emphasis. Yeah. And that's an area that he's come into our organization wanting to address. He's been criticized probably unfairly. People associate their record with his defense and any of the deficiencies he may have had. He's a competitor. So when you're a number one pick and you're as talented as he is and he's a young guy that's still learning, when he hears something, you see his competitive side come out, and you see him wanting to address it. So I think that's the part of this specific that he's referring to. What were some of the things that you saw just watching those first three games in Las Vegas in respect to Markel? Um, fluid. He's, he's, he's fearless. He's very fluid with or without the basketball. He knows how to score. He scores in a variety of ways behind the three-point line with the mid-range pull-up. He can get downhill into the rim. I think the thing I enjoy watching him the most is that he's a very willing ball mover. Just gets off the ball easily. He's not one of those guys that's going to pound it. Uh, and and any time you're a willing ball handler, a willing passer, your teammates enjoy playing with you. And I think our guys are going to like playing with him you guys try as the summer goes along to introduce more stuff to them or is it just repeating some of the same concepts on both ends? Well, it's, it's to get better. So the goal is to be better at what we've introduced them to. So whether it's a defensive concept or one of our offensive sets, run it a little bit better next time. You know, find a different option. Be a little bit tighter or a little bit sharper. Use the screen a little bit better. So I think the goal is to just improve upon what we've given them before we start adding more and more to it. We'll have an entire year, an entire season to give them a lot more. What would you like to see Furcon focus on? Just confidence. You know, he just got off a plane, what, three days ago? He flew in and jumped into a game and obviously struggled in that first one shooting the basketball. But he's a shooter. He's an athlete. He's a gifted passer. He is a skilled basketball player. I think if he just goes out there and plays with confidence, I think he'll be fine.